Many patients with ET and PV are treated with a drug known as hydroxyurea or hydroxycarbamide. Um, this is a very effective treatment for these um, diseases and is probably the most commonly prescribed drug uh, worldwide for patients with myeloproliferative neoplasms. If the drug is working and without side effects, then many patients may well stay on that drug for the rest of their life. If the drug is not working so well or there are side effects, then there needs to be a discussion between the patient and the clinician about what those side effects are. So common side effects with hydroxyurea, for example, might be mouth ulcers, leg ulcers. We know that the drug increases the risk of sun-induced skin damage and skin cancer. So if there are skin changes, for example, that might lead us to want to stop the drug. Sometimes the drug is not quite effective enough at controlling the blood counts, but it's good enough. So it's a little bit about individuality. Generally, 75 to 80% of patients will remain on that drug without changing it.